I am Dr. Pramod Reddy Kandakure. I am the Clinical Director, Cardiothoracic and Vascular Surgery, Aortic Aneurysm Surgery and Minimal Invasive Surgeon in Care Hospital, High Tech City, Hyderabad. So today I am going to discuss about VAT surgery, video assisted thoracoscopic surgery. So in this, what surgeries can be done? It's a minimal invasive surgery done through the camera, putting a camera like a same like a laparoscopic surgery, we can do this surgery as a thoracoscopic surgery. So we used two or three ports in the in this one. Sometimes it is a little bigger working port is there, or sometimes we do a uniportal pads. So only one incision is there and we put camera and everything through that incision. So what surgeries can be done? It's a thoracic surgeries can also be done and then heart surgery also can be done. Thoracic surgery is a lung surgeries. We can remove or take a biopsy from the lung. We can remove some mass from the lung or we can do a one part of the uh, lobe of the lung also. We can remove through this procedure. Also, the mediastinal tumors. There are tumors in the chest where uh, anterior mediastinum, middle mediastinum, posterior mediastinum, depending upon the which mediastinum is involved, we choose the port, uh, port sites and uh, remove the mass through the VATS procedure. Also, the cardiac surgery also can be done like ASD closure can be done, VSD closures can be done, mitral valve surgeries, aortic valve surgeries can be done through the video assisted thoracoscopic surgery with a small incision and then the remaining are the working port for the camera and the instruments. So the advantages of doing uh, VATS is the same advantages as minimally invasive uh, surgery plus th there are very less scar and then the patient will have less pain and it's very cosmetical, uh, cosmetic surgery. So the patient can be uh, recovered very faster and patient can be discharged in 3 to 5 days time in thoracic surgery or maybe 5 to 7 days time in the heart surgery and the patient can get back to normal activities in like two to three weeks time. So these are the advantages and these are the recent uh, technologies. So in future, we are planning to do a robotic surgery, which is the extension of the video assisted thoracoscopic surgery, where the all procedures can be done with the help of the robot. So the robotic arms can, uh, we can use the robotic arms to do the surgery instead of using the long instruments. So which will give added benefit to the patients with a faster recovery. Thank you.